Usaidi tukimilua yuko mlia. Yuko ye. Usaidi tukimilua yuko mlia. No god, no god. Yuko ye tinga timipla loka. You like your companies. You can come in. You can finish. Oh, thank you. Me promise welcome, you come. Welcome. You come inside. Thank you. Thank you through. Cross one bell. I can kiss him quite well, and I can kiss him strong. The bush blow me, and I can run. Bush, I'm, I'm say give me plant, good plant, good plant benefit to come inside. Bush, I'm not say lose him in the garden, but I grab him in the bush. I'm say only me, and bring him over good plant, good plant something to come inside. And I say kiss him strong and tough long. Bush ground blow me, and I say stand up, and I say run on the water. So I'm logging him come, so I'm come by him by come short plant time. Now I'm by go, now I'm by finish. Lo one plat time, ini one plat time. Atau nampak mungkin setiap musim dua tiga years nampak finish tak sah. Mungkin musim konservasi nampak mungkin mungkin kisim long plat time. Mungkin kisim long plat time, long time long mil, nampak long time long pikir ini, nampak long time long tumbuh na. Konservasi nampak sana long plat time straight. seemed to be a fairly natural fit that we would be able to supply services and provide contacts uh, that would be of use uh, to a very sensitive uh, project in amongst um, a very thriving forestry industry. Research isn't done um, without the um, assistance um, from the local, the local population um, and certainly in a remote part of the world such as this uh, the resources that they have, um, particularly when being tempted by loggers uh, to, to find an alternative use for their forests, um, does mean that this project has become more than just a straight scientific research project. Um, I'm delighted that obviously we started the Wanang School, um, 150 students uh, where there was no school before, um, I think is, 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 is absolutely critical to ensure this project is sustainable. The Wana community is, is unique in having approached an uh, international team of scientists to do research on their land. They had already uh, decided among themselves that they wanted to commit to preserving their forest for future generations. The question is how to do that given the economic realities of rural Papua New Guinea. Support from Swire was instrumental in bringing together an international team of scientists and a group of landowners committed to sustaining their environment. Without corporate support, we couldn't have done it. Papua New Guinea is one of the uh, most important areas in the world for biodiversity and biodiversity conservation in the 21st century. Our principal scientific ambition is to understand how the forests of the world are changing. That's what we've got the global network for. We had no plot up until two years ago in the whole area of Australasia, Australia, New Guinea, any of the Pacific Islands, and so that whole rainforest was not represented in the network. The level of detail and the level of long-term sustainable research that's going to be required to understand how rainforests work and more importantly I think how rainforests are impacted um, by events happening tens of thousands of miles away. I think the Smithsonian's been doing great work in Panama and other parts of the world um, but to be able to add Papua New Guinea as, as part of that research um, I think is absolutely critical. I would like to think that this research station will be here in a hundred years' time, um, still analysing the effects of, of, of world climate change um, on these very precious rainforests. Suppose Narapolo last red line coming said now, or support him now, or strong him plus red. You got this one looks up a stab at him, by me playing up long. All him does something and goes up long, but I'm straight. And to make this project sustainable, um, certainly I'd like to think that Swaz will be there alongside uh, both the, the scientists uh, as well as the villagers uh, as we continue to expand uh, our knowledge. On behalf of John Swar and Sons, um, I'd like to thank um, not only the researchers that have obviously made this project possible, more importantly perhaps is that 
without the, the local villagers um, um, being part of this project, uh, wanting to be owners of this project, um, it wouldn't have happened. Um, so I'd like to thank uh, Philip, the head man, um, and all the villagers um, of Wenang. <laughs> Thank you.